Ah, proper spring. Really nice. And the weather forecast for today is good. It's a Saturday. It's Saturday the 23rd of May 2015. 06.42. I've got 12 minutes before my bus arrives. Last week, I was going to go to the Cambrian Tab and I discovered extra staff training. This week, it's actually open. Okay, I'm thinking the willows to start because it is May and it is 10 years on. But I fancy some, fancy some fine ales and if I'm not in too much of a state, famous last words, I fancy popping back to the gravity station just for the hell of it. Wine Brewery doing a tap takeover at uh, Brewdog Cardiff on Sunday. Although I'll be gardening, but if you're near, pop in. Quality brood. So, that's sad day planned. Or not, as the case may be. So, the Philly International. And the sky. Well, it's all turned a little bit more blue. Okay, so I'm going to smoke and the boil. New. Cardiff Green Street. And sort of off the He's a nice day. Okay, here's one of the reasons. Guest Ale's 189. Okay, guest ale's 189. I'm in. And we're off on the dot of nine. Gravitas Bale Brewery, nothing to do with the Bale of Glamorgan, nothing is Buckinghamshire. 4.8% alcohol by volume. I'd say golden ale. I'm suspecting lemony. Um, world champion Mr Manning who's currently in Vienna for the um, Eurovision Song Contest. Look at the flooring here sir. Hmm, smells a little bit citrusy. That's nice. More of a gentle citrusy finish. You know what, with the weather outside, Oh, there somewhere. I'm thinking that's a summer ale. B plus. Number two. I'm now working on my unique so I'm on halves. This is Black Stallion by the Arundel Brewery. I've been there, he says, as <laughs> it goes out. Um, Handcraft Sussex Ale. Lightly hopped, dark, chocolatey, and I'm looking 3.7% alcohol by volume. Okay. Mmm, smells. smells rich, if that makes any sense. Mmm, sort of dark, fruity, sort of rich taste, B. Plus. Very nice. 95p because I'm on a half. Gotta periscope this while I still can. Number three is also a half from Devonshire. Shepherd's Crook, 4.7% alcohol by volume, X Valley Brewery. It's supposed to be coffee. Can't smell anything. Let's, let's go for the taste, because my nose is rubbish anyway. Hmm. I gotta be honest, there's a sort of um, semi sweet, malty sort of taste to it. B plus. Number three Victory at Waterloo. JW Lee's 4.5% alcohol by volume. Um, Trying not to piss off our friend 
cousins, because we really like the French. They don't like us that much. Although certain ones do ask some Venga, P.Y. Jabot, and um, Patrick Beja, who's not Patrick on Twitter. Who I like a lot, even if I don't care. Anyway, let's have a crack. No aroma. No aroma to me, I should say, because my nose is rubbish. Bit watery. Not a great deal of taste. That's a victory. B, which is two and a half out of five. You know. Okay, number 10, number 2, and it's open. Okay, what have we got? Black Mountain, Bragging Rice, Barry Island IPA, Atlantic Point. 18 draft taps, specialist pies. I've got to be honest, it's looking good. Although, at my age, I'm not worried about the toilet. So, okay, I mean, that's the wall, that's one of the entrance doors, the big enterprise, that's keg, that's nice lot of bottles as well, and cans, because cans are good. Anyway, working on my uniques, this is Cambrian Pale, probably named after the fact that this is the Cambrian Tap. 4.6% alcohol by volume. Nice bit of wood on the floor, Mr. Manning. Okay, so what's it taste like? This is, well, I think it's new to me. Mm, slight yeasty smell. Mm. Bit weak, but citrus brings it back. It's B plus, but only just. That's a bit of a shocker. 2.75 on the untapped scale. Okay, Am um, Wild Beer Co. <gasps> Who you can't eat. Madness IPA. 6.8% alcohol by volume. Okay, it says hops, hops, more hops. Actually, it says hops, hops, and hops. You can smell the hops. You can taste the hops. It's hoppy goodness. It's B plus plus. I don't expect my beers in the fridge. I'm kind of hoping. Poor chips. All the empty bottles. They sort of remind me of motor lambic. Oh, do key. This is probably going to get pulled up from YouTube. Through the metal, 5.5 by the wine brewery. Sue Haywood, gravity station, excellent people. And they saved my bottle. I couldn't even remember what it was. Says so on the dotting oh, count, 5.5% alcohol by volume. Review to follow. Um, okay, can be in tap of the gravity station. Gravity station. Easily. So back. I don't know why I just didn't continue, but you know. Rudimental wine brewery, 5.5% alcohol by volume. No rain, nice sunny day. Hoppy ale. Mm. Mostly in the finish. B plus in a bit. 3.25 on top scale. Okay, this is the one I left behind. 
Saison de Dutch I looked on the label, Brasserie de Rank. I'm thinking this is going to be good. Next radio. Okay. Oh, smells so sunny. Sharp. That's a season. That's B plus plus. You have to like them. I do. Bitter, sharp, Belgian. That's for a long time. 